Oh, right, not the best start to the day. Somebody's had me pump away overnight. Oh, fuck. Uh, so now I've got to uh, put my tyres up with a, a mini pump, which isn't the best while touring. Uh, I've had two days here in Suricata. Well, for, actually three nights in Suricata. Um, fucked up the, day, the other day. I, and I was just so knackered. So I just went to a restaurant and just ate pretty much all day. Uh, I feel I was feeling fucking fresh this morning and then, yeah, no pump. Rig's changed as well. I've got this big, big dry bag. And I've got myself a sleeping bag ready for, uh, ready for Australia. And it's a pretty good kit, 30 litre dry bag as well. So, right, we're heading north, north south, south east to uh, Woola, Woolaloogi or something like that. And then another town east of there, which is about, the first stop is gonna be about 40 k's. And then I'll, I'll just try and get it done. They were fucking around in the hotel looking for it and somebody's had it away off my bike. So yeah, if you do get the option, you know, even if the person tells you, yeah, it'll be safe somewhere, if you've got the option to put it in the room, put it in the room. Um, yeah, I, thought, I fucking, I fucking knew it. I should, I should have put it in the room. It's, it's me being a, being a dickhead, trusting people. Um, yeah, fuck's sake. That's where I stayed the other day. <laughs> and I'm now passing it. <laughs> Two days later, three days later. <laughs> fuck. Oh, fuck my life. Just come across this van. Try and be quick with this because it's. Uh, this is just disgusting, man. This is this is what we put these animals through. They're layered on top of each other, just thrown in, just shitting on each other, and just. And this is this is what the majority of the people eat is. Oh. You cannot be an animal lover and eat animals at the same time. You're a fucking hypocrite. You are a hypocrite. Woo! This is a nice view. Got the big mountains in the back there. Shit. Um, I'm presuming that was the hill that I tried to get up yesterday. Not the day before, sorry. Steep bastard. So today, this road is just up and down, up and down, up and down. There we go. See me? Maybe. Uh, Bus is everywhere. I've not filmed a whole lot because I've had to concentrate a lot. I, fuck, when, when buses overtake you on the downhill, on the inside, no, when buses overtake you on the downhill on a left hand corner, what are they thinking? What are they thinking? Like, these are honestly some of the worst drivers, inconsiderate, not inconsiderate because we do beep, but they'll beep maybe 20 centimeters away from you, and it's the loudest fucking horn. Um, it's just so, it's just, there's just too many people here. There's too many people on the planet. That's all I can think of, that's all I can say, because it's not like, it's just their, their driving style. You know, we're not used to seeing cyclists on here, so treating the same as a bike, motorbike, and you know, maybe a bit of a similar speed. 
they don't care, man. Um, I'm like, I'm like the fucking pond scum to them, you know? Um, I'm lower than pond scum. You are lower than pond scum. You got a problem with that? Jordan? No. No problem at all. On the roads. Uh, but it's views like these that make the day. Yeah. Right, 60, 64 k's in, and I've got about 30 k's to go, 35 I think, fingers crossed, uh, to Ponarologo, something like that, Ponarologo, Pronarologo, I don't know, but see what happens. Coming down this road. This is the view to my left. Rice fields and mountains. And pink skies. Beautiful. Coming a vegan chap chai. Uh, just vegetables only. They'll throw in all sorts of stuff. Seafood, meat. Eggs and this joint, um, we can basically pick as many plates of rice as we want. So I've gone for two, got another plate of chopped you know. So it looks like two per plate, so four bowls of rice, um, two plates of chopped chai. If I can stomach it, I'll probably eat a bit more. I've just been working out on the maps as well, it's gonna take at least. Six days from here. Uh, tomorrow I should be I should be okay uh, for another hundred kilometers ish. A day later, I think I'm only going to be able to do 50 k's because the the road is just I've checked the terrain. It's just mental. And then the day after, if I'm still in good condition, another 50 k's, and then about 70, 80 k's, and then. Yeah, uh, that's as far as I plan, but it's going to be at least another two days after that. Uh, whether I want to go up Bromo um, in the van or whatever, go for a hike, maybe. Go up Ingen, maybe. Egen. Uh, but I'm not, I'm not too sure, so I'll just see how it goes. Not been, up to, not been able to uh, upload any videos or in, even Instagram uh, photos, uh, unless I'm at fucking shitting in McDonald's. Um, yeah, the 3G here is, is pretty poor now. Uh, whether it's better with a different um, network, I'm not too sure, but Dudu sold me the uh, SIM card, said this would work here as well. So, yeah, not too sure. But anyway, it's a bit of a stressful day. Um, I lost my shit a couple of times, like, coaches coming really fucking close, really, really close. Um, you've just got to have your head on a swivel. It is, a, it is quite a dangerous place, if I'm honest. Um, I was a bit cheesed off about my pump, but shit happens. Anyway, right, I'm going to sign off for tonight. I'll, uh, yeah, see you through, uh, see you through the window. Peace.